in the heart of Orange County, California, you'll find the city of Tustin with pretty residential neighborhoods, good schools, and a quaint historic downtown, Fortune Magazine ranked it as one of the best places to live for families. But how did Tustin get its name? <laughs> I have no idea. Go ahead. <laughs> it's your turn. Mm, I have no idea. I actually have no idea. Uh, I have no idea. <laughs> Tustin was named after this gentleman, Columbus Tustin. Why don't you walk down to the museum with me and we'll learn more about him. Columbus Tustin was from a pioneering family. Uh, he was born in Philadelphia and then he grew up in Illinois. And then they kind of got the gold fever in 1849. They came down to the Bay Area during the gold rush. And eventually they settled in Petaluma, California. And uh, Columbus Tustin stayed there for about 20 years. And then in 1868, one of his business partners he and one of his business partners came down to this area and they purchased about a thousand acres of land. They divided it up between themselves. He laid out uh, plots, he uh, put in streets, planted trees. Uh, he built the first school. Um, uh, the town just slowly started to develop. There was a general store, a blacksmith shop, a church was built. Um, and at the same time that he was doing that, just a few miles away, Santa Ana was being developed and kind of a rivalry between these two towns for who would get the uh, Southern Pacific Railroad. That rivalry developed and then Santa Ana won that battle. They became the county seat, a large thriving city. And Tustin for years was kind of uh, relegated to being a small agricultural farming town. And then Columbus Tustin passed away in 1883 at the age of 57. And he never got to see or realize the success that this town that he founded would eventually become. Tustin has a, a long, rich history uh, with some very interesting stories about people who lived here, things that happened here. Yeah, the museum is, uh, would be inviting for children. We have, a, we have an old fire truck that they're invited to get up behind the wheel and, and try it. It's always popular. Uh, we have school, old school displays. Um, it's just a very um, family-friendly, inviting museum, and we would, it, we would definitely invite people to come down and, and enjoy. Oh wow, I don't even That's know. That's how we came to the museum to find out. <laughs>